Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Tuesday the 26th of December 2023. Only a few more days left in 2023 and we'll be hopefully into a better new year. Better new year next year, year next year. But I've been saying that for the last few years and it hasn't been coming true. But <laughs> I'm always optimistic. Um, do you think that um, humor should ever be a part of war. I wonder. I'm not sure. Um, sometimes maybe it's the only way people can deal with war. Um, but I, I mentioned this because um, uh, just a short time ago, a few hours ago, uh, a Russia, uh, sorry, a, a Ukrainian missile hit a, a Russian ship. Russia has confirmed it although it's refusing to say just how much damage has been done. There are videos around of uh, huge fires on the ship. And um, <laughs> the uh, Ukrainian uh, uh, ministry has wryly announced that it has converted the ship into a submarine, humor showing its humor. Um, I, I think that, that, one, that joke might be appropriate. I think that one might be okay. But in general, I'm not, not really... In favor of making light of war. Um, it's just too difficult a topic. Um, but anyway, let's get on with the game of Sudoku as supplied to us by the Los Angeles Times expert level game. Uh, so I'm going to start with the fours blocking down here since they are calling to me. And there's another four here in the middle I can grab. I uh, don't think there are any on this side, though, that we can deal with just yet. Maybe coming soon. We have five down here, five up there, five across there. So let's sneak in a five. We have five down here, so five in one of these squares blocking up here, and then the fives back that way. Five down here, five across there, so there's a five, and we'll take that to the top as well. Fives and get ourselves five up there. So fives across here and across here and down there mean fives are out of the way already. I do not see any twos on the board, do you? I was looking to see which numbers are missing from here, and I thought two is a missing digit. Where are the other twos? And I see nada. So, okay, let's do something else. Seven's blocking across, and a seven up there will fit seven into that square. Um, but it looks like we're going to get our first two because, okay, we've got eight blocking like this and across here, so that's going to be eight. And then we've got eights blocking down here like this, so that's an eight down here. And we've got one blocking this square, so that's going to be one, and that will be our first two. We also have one down here, one across there. Nine blocking down here, there's our nine. This will be a six. Six blocks up here and across there, there's a six. Three blocks this square, so that's our three in this column, that's our two. Two blocking down here, there's our two. Missing digit here, seven. And we have the middle bit filled out, don't we already? But um, that doesn't mean it's going to make it easy. Uh, 
sometimes it's better to have digits all around you know right across the grid rather than in one shoot only I find that anyway Maybe we'll go through the digits now. Okay, we've got one and eight blocking up, one and eight blocking up here, or one and eight blocking across there. So that's a pair of one and eight. What does it mean? Uh, well, it means threes are in those squares, so threes are there. Anything else we know about threes? Not enough. Okay. Right, again, one and eight are here. What else do we know? Ah, okay. This has to be one. This is a pair of one and eight, right? This is one or eight only. Now, one and eight is forbidden here. One and eight must be in those squares there. No, two could be in either, right? I thought I discovered something, but... One and eight, yes, one and eight, yes, of course it is. I was right, one, eight, and two missing from here. Yes, of course it is, one and eight are blocked from here. That's going to be two. I was lo lost confidence in my own logic there for a second. Never mind, it's back again. It's a very strange my window is vibrating must be some must be a motor or some other thing nearby Uh, I'm going to go through the digits, see if we can spot anything. I started with one, and I spotted the one eight, so so stopped. All right, let's try again. Uh, well, with the three, with the threes, I know that they are there, as I mentioned. Also, now I know that they are in those squares there. Although I'm not sure that how that helps, but I do know that that's true. Oops, hitting the boom arm. All right, maybe I'll try and remember that for later. Fours are, fives are done.
Uh, this is four and nine, four and nine across there. We have a pair of four and nine in those squares. Okay, this has to be one and six. So sixes have to be in one of these two squares here. Look, sixes are there. Sixes have to be one of those two squares. Six blocking down, we'll get ourselves a six there. Uh, I forgot what I said. Four and nine were here. One and six over here. So two, three, eight in these squares. Two, three, eight. Threes are here. Uh, okay, so I said earlier on that three, okay, this is, uh, I said earlier on that threes are in those squares, right? So three blocks down here, three blocks down here, three across there. There is our three. Eight blocks down here, eight blocks across here, so eight's in one of those squares, blocking up here, up here. This will be our 8. Now, of course, this will be a 1, because we did have 8 and 1 in those squares. Uh, we need a 1 at the end of this row now. In fact, 2 and 8 down here, 2 and 8 across there. So this is a pair of 2 and 8. We know this was uh, 4 and 9. 2, 8, 4, 9. So this has to be a 7, doesn't it? Six blocking up here, six down there, there's our six. Um, three and six here, three and six blocking across there. That's a pair of three and six. So if that's three and six back here, we're looking for one and something. So we'll see the blocking one. So there's the one and the something, which is not three or six, is seven. Seven across here, across here, up there, and down there. Is that the last? Yes, that's the final seven. Uh, now, three and... S oh, okay, we'll do this. One blocking across here, one down here, one across there. There's our... Digit one, one down here, one across here, one across there. There's the final digit one. This was three, and let's do this. Nine across here, nine up there. There's our nine. Eight blocks this square. We need eight in this row. It must occupy that square. Can't be anywhere else. Eight up there, eight across there. There is our eight. And the last number here is a two. Two also blocks across there. There's our two.
6 blocks this square, and there's our 6 for this column. The last number in the column is a 3, and that puts 3 into that square there. And the last number up here is a 9, I think, isn't it? Okay, we also have 9 blocking here, so there's a 9. And one number to go over here, which is the 4, which would be very useful. Blocking down here, there's the 4. This would be a 9. 9 down here and 9 down there. There's our 9. This would be a 4, I remember. And this is half a dozen. 6 blocking up here. There's our 6. Uh, missing number here is a 3. 3 blocking down here and across there. There's the final digit, 3. Here we need a 2 to finish. 2 blocks across here. There's our 2. We still need a 2 in that block there. And an 8 goes here and an 8 goes there and that's the end of the game. So that's our Boxing Day evening puzzle solved from the Los Angeles Times. Thank you. See you around.